Hello friends, welcome to my channel Technical Arpen, myself Arnab Kodu. Today I will discuss another new topic which is green computing. So today I will discuss what is green computing. Actually green computing is also known as green IT. Okay. Also I discuss what are the benefits of green computing, what are the advantages and what are the limitations and also what are the applications of green computing and also discuss what the future of green computing is concerned okay so go to the computer screen i will discuss elaborately about the topic green computing okay hello friends today i will discuss the topic green computing okay a contribution to save the environment right at first, we should know what is green computing. Green computing or green IT refers to environmentally sustainable computing or IT, right? It is the study and practice of designing, manufacturing, using and disposing of computers, servers and associated subsystems such as monitors, printers, storage devices and networking and communications systems efficiently and effectively with minimal or no impact on the environment right green computing refers to durable computing of the environment right this reduces the use of electricity as well as power and reduces environmental waste when we are using a computer okay Green computing is the environmentally responsible and eco-friendly use of computers and their resources. Okay. Going green is a rising trend establishing itself as the preferred way of doing things while saving the environment. Right. This now appears in a large number of aspects in our lives such as recycling, energy efficient devices, clean energy sources, eco-friendly vehicles, green buildings. Okay. Seymour Peppert, he was a South African born American mathematician. In his book, Mindstorms, he said that there is a world of difference between what computers can do and what society will choose to do with them okay now we talk about some history of green computing in 1992 the u.s environmental protection agency epa launched energy star a voluntary leveling program which is designed to promote and recognize energy efficiency in monitors climate control equipment and other technologies Okay, this resulted in the widespread adoption of sleep mode among consumer electronics. Okay, the term green computing was probably coined shortly after the Energy Star program began. Okay, the Energy Star labeled has now certified more than 75 different product categories, homes, commercial buildings and industrial plants, etc. Okay. Now we talk about some goals of green computing. There are different objectives of green computing and they are like to minimize the implementation of hazardous products, more production of energy efficiency, to use the recyclability of wasted product and factory wasted products. Okay. To design proper algorithms for improve the computer's efficiency. Okay. In broad terms, it is also defined as the study of designing, engineering, manufacturing, using and disposing of computing devices in a way that reduces their environmental impact. Okay. Now you talk about the applications of green computing. There are many areas in which use the green computing like energy management in data centers, green cloud computing in energy efficiency, 
green wireless network, green parallel computing with big data systems, green cloud computing along with genetic algorithm. Okay. The strategies of green computing have decreased the consumption of overhead energy and have used the server maximum through a strategy including server virtualization. Right. But technology trends such as increase in data analytics and artificial intelligence can reduce progress in green computing strategies. Right. Green computing involves reducing the environmental impact of technology. Right. Now we talk about some advantages of green computing. Lessened vitality utilization by green registering advances converts into low carbon dioxide emissions which emerge because of the absence of petroleum derivatives utilized as a part of intensity plants and transportation. Okay. Conservation of resources means less energy is required to produce, use and dispose of products. Okay. Saving energy and resources saves money. Green processing includes changing government arrangement to empower reusing by people and organizations and to lessen vitality utilization. Okay. Reduce existing exposure in laptops such as chemical cancer nerve damage and is known due to immune responses in humans okay now talk about some challenges of green computing it can really be quite expensive okay some green computers may be very low okay rapid technology change right According to Intel CEO Bob Swan, he said that one company cannot solve climate change. Okay. I conclude today's topic, green computing. At the most simple level, green computing is not a rocket science and certainly does not require large amounts of cash in case of upfront investment. Right. The active step for a green computing takes a little effort yet low energy consumption usually changes to immediate savings right energy efficiency and e-waste are two major techniques involved in green computing okay i hope you have understood today's topic and today's topic was green computing okay I hope that you have understood today's topic. For more videos, keep watching my channel Technical Arcoin. Thank you and bye bye.